Oh, my poor kingdom, sick with civil blows, <laughs> when that my care could not withhold thy riot. What wilt thou do when riot is thy care? <gasps> thou be a wilderness again. <laughs> Peopled with wolves, thy old inhabitants. Pardon me, my liege, there is your crown. And he that wears the crown immortally, long guarded yours, if I affect it more than as your honor and as your renown, let me no more from this obedience rise. God witnessed with me when I here came in and found no course of breath within your majesty. How cold it struck my heart. If I do feign, oh, let me in my present wildness die and never live to show the incredulous world the noble change that I have purposed it, coming to look on you, thinking you dead and dead almost, my liege, to think you were. I spake unto the crown as having sense and thus upbraided it, the care on thee depending hath fed upon the body of my father. And thou, most fine, most honoured, most renowned, hath eat thy bearer up, then my most royal liege, accusing it, I put it on my head, to try with it as with an enemy who had before my face murdered my father. But if it did infect my blood with joy, or swell my thoughts to any strain of pride, if any rebel or vain spirit of mine did with the least affection of a welcome give entertainment to the might of it. Let God forever keep it from my head and make me as the poorest vassal is who doth with awe and terror kneel to it. <laughs> 